Good morning. It's um, probably about 7.30 a.m. What time is it exactly? Let's figure that out right now. It's 7.30. Wow, 7.30 on the nose. Holy shit, I've, I nailed that shit. <laughs> Anyways, it's time to go for the first run since the Ultra. I'm recovered. I haven't done shit in... It's been five days now. It's Monday, so Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Five day, four day, five days. Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I haven't done shit in four days. Um, just been hanging, eating. Thanksgiving break is the best. It truly is. I just didn't do, and starting it with an ultra was perfect, because then I just had every excuse in the world to just do nothing. But now it's time to get my ass back in gear. It's time to go for a run. Let's get it. Wednesday run day. I took Chili out for a walk this morning and it was freezing, so I got the tights on. Long sleeve shirt. Got the Brooks. Got Kells. Chili. Cats are fighting. It's a chaotic morning in the household. No, it has been a happy morning. I, I made a Taylor Swift remix. Actually, you know what? I'll play it right here as I get my shoes on. Who? Taylor? What if Taylor sees it? I have a vision that one of Cody's remixes will end up on an album, or she'll just post it. Maybe, maybe once they're not trash at producing. I think you're the best. It'll happen. But let me know if you like that, I'll put it up on SoundCloud. I have no idea if it's cool or not, to be honest. I can get it. I just don't really know what genre it is. It's soft. And Julie's not the camera. <sighs> there he is. Okay, let's hit it. I think I might do it. 10 bagger this morning. Kind of feeling dece, so we'll see. Um, so it's been exactly a week since the Ultra. The birthday Ultra, annual birthday Ultra. Damn, that sucks, I just locked myself into doing it next year. Whoops, should have thought about that before I said it. Uh, ah, dude, I, I'm just not recovered from it. That's the main point, that's what I wanted to say when I turned on my camera. But I can't because I'm too out of fucking breath. I'm not recovered, I can feel my body is still just like, I feel fatigued. I thought I'd be totally good by now. I'm not sore or anything, I'm just fatigued. Fatigue weighed, as it's pronounced. Ah, fuck, I'm only running at nine, nine minute pace. So I was going, trying to go for a 10 bagger, but who knows if that'll be the case. Okay, well, um, so I don't know if I updated you after the last run, but it was, it was pretty horrendous, honestly. I just, I had to call it at like six miles or something like that. And uh, just because I felt still just like so run down. So I called it, I walked a decent chunk of it too. And now it's Friday and I'm going out for a little redemption run. But honestly, I mean, I'm just in that fucking phase. Like right after you do something really hard where you're just like trying, trying to find the motivation to like keep working out and like thinking about the next thing potentially. I'm just scraping the bottom of the barrel. I'm like sitting on the couch, like no part of me wants to go for a run, which is weird. And I'm tired, but um, <clears throat> I'm going out. It's fucking freezing cold right now. It's like 72. <laughs> I'm kidding, it is pretty chilly. It must be like 55 or something like that, but I'm bundled up, I got the tights on. I love a good cold run. And hopefully I don't feel horrible again. I'm gonna take it slow. Just try to enjoy. That's all it is, try to enjoy it. But yeah, man, we're in that, I'm in that phase. It's the holiday season, baby's coming. I'm like, what's the point? Why don't I just rest? And then I'm like, no, fucking, we should work at, go out for an hour. It's not gonna fucking kill you. You know, it's ups and downs, you know? It's that part of your brain that's like, you deserve some time off, man. You did a fucking 33 mile ultra marathon. But then the problem is if I, if I let that part of my brain take over too much, then it's all, then I'm, I have a hard time getting back. So the solution is just to stay on, but just less on. How's that for a quote? Put that on a, on a shirt. Basically this all boils down to energy is everything, if you really think about it. And that's what it boils down to. It's as simple as that. Okay. Wow, I just committed the cardinal sin of running. I stopped my watch and then I forgot to start it again. Oh fuck. So it's, it says I've run 20 minutes when really I've done at least 28. <laughs> That's a bummer, two miles. I know for a fact I'm three and a half miles in. <sighs> Is there even any point to continuing? Now that little section, that little mile and a half right there, loss to the essence of time. Just off the grid completely. What's the point, you know? Sadness. No, I'm kidding. You know, it's good to get off the grid every now and then. 
<laughs> unplug, you know? Enjoy nature. You know, you guys are so busy on your phone screens. I've said this before, but not me. I like to go for miles with not a single GPS satellite in view. All right, well, actually this is going pretty well. I feel good. <laughs> Weirdly, I was like really not, this is always when it happens, man. You're like, I don't wanna go and then you just feel amazing. So yeah, I've been feeling good. So I'm gonna start my watch now and continue the journey. <laughs> Hear that beep? We're on the grid now. Okay. Thank you. Okay, success. Five and a half miles, but we know what the real mileage was. Come on. Man, you know what it really was. But, you know, for the sake of being off the grid, I'm gonna just say it was five and a half miles. That's it. Yeah, that's all I did today. Five and a half. It was an easy one. <laughs> just did five and a half. You know what I mean? You know? God, you know, <laughs> not fucking around. Come on. I know you know what I'm saying. Ah, trucks, trucks. I love trucks. Okay, so, so here's the thing. Reason why I wanted to get out, one of the reasons why I wanted to get out here this morning. First of all, fucking beautiful day. So happy I came out. I always am. It's always worth it. Go, go outside, always worth it. Even if it's snowing, get out there. It's so worth it every time. <sighs> but also because, I'll tell you about it in a second. Let me, let me just, in one second. Sorry, I had a shower real quick. Okay, so the thing, the thing that I wanted to tell you, one of the reasons why I wanted to go out this morning is because we're going to this thing called Chain Fest tonight, and it's just like, I don't know what it is, but it's just food. Like, it's a food festival of some sort. I don't know exactly. I wish I just looked up what it was so I could tell you what it was, but I just know that there's going to be delicious food there. So I'm kind of like, I'm going to be as hungry as possible, you know? So I can eat. I just, as I said that, my stomach growled so loud. I'm going to eat a little breakfast, but then I'm going to fast till Chain Fest. Go potty. Guys, thank you for watching another week. Sorry for, you know, the sort of lack of training this week and the struggle with motivation. But as I said, I got to document everything. So I try to figure out what the next race is right now and getting ready for the birth of my child. So that's what's up. Should I do a favorite comment? BBM Ski, your support system is everything. Well done, happy B-Day, brother. I totally agree. I'm extremely lucky to have such a, you know, supportive wife and friends, and uh, I don't take that for granted. So um, when I used to do the ocean swims every Wednesday, the coach, God, I forget his name. He was fucking awesome. He was uh, like a champion open water swimmer or something, or maybe a triathlete, I forget. But he was a very accomplished guy, and he was like in endurance sports, and he, would, uh, he gave a speech one time that was like, I think it was before the holidays, and he was like, take this time to be with your family because they deal with your fucking bullshit when you go out here and you swim and you run and you bike and you're fucking gone for hours and that's all about you and they support you so make sure you take this time to like help them and support them and be with them so that's not lost on me either so anyways uh thanks for another uh great week and uh it's it's monday right now i just woke up early and did a seven mile run so we're on a, we're on good pace this week choo choo and um energy is everything you already know the drill goodbye <laughs>